Okie dokie, let's see. <laughs> so far, not so good. Let's see what happens here. What is going on everyone? Riddick here and welcome to Off The Shelf Air Guns. Today we're going to take the Hot Sawn Sortie Tact and uh, do a little bit of accuracy with it. See what we're doing at 25, see what we're doing at 50. We're going to see. All right. The Hot Sawn Sortie Tact, 22 caliber. We are going to see what it's doing at longer distances. We're going to start out at 25, then we're going to try 50. We're not going 100. I'm just trying the open sights that are included with it, of course, you know, off the shelf, right? Here we go. All right, we are sat up here at 25 yards. We're gonna see what we're doing here with the sortie with the Hawkeye pointed they are heavy the heaviest one i got so i'm just curious to see what kind of groups we can get with these and that is the uh pretty much the goal see what kind of groups we're getting and then we'll go from there here we go <laughs> see what happens here Okay. Can't see it. Hey, hey, hey. All right, here we go. Okay. There you go. That's uh, one down. We got one to go with the Ultra Magnums. So we're gonna go ahead and do those right now. I'll try and uh, get that aimed more on the bottom. It looks like those were hitting up above. Not a big fan of those, by the way. Just <laughs> wanted to see what they would do. All right, now we got Crossman Ultra Magnum. Let's try to aim a little lower. I don't know if I am or not. A ting. <laughs> I didn't even try that ting. And that's that. And of course, they name a whole lot lower because they're pretty much up there with the other ones. So obviously, I should have compensated a little more because these are much, well, not much, but they're lighter than the Hawkeyes. But uh, yeah, there you go. As far as open sights, that's what we're doing at 25 yards. I got a little jumpy on a couple of them. What else is new? That's what we're doing. 25 yards. Doesn't look like the tightest groups in the world. Maybe it is. I don't know. I can barely see it as far as that goes. But uh, you've seen it before me. So I'm going to go get it. Take a look at it. There it is. I don't know. Not the best in the world. Not the best in the world. 25 yards. Whatever. But uh, that's what we got. Nothing too uh, impressive, but hey, what are you gonna do, right? up here at 50 yards we're gonna see what this thing can do 
I know 25 wasn't very impressive. I wasn't very impressed with 25 either. Uh, I never have a problem with the Crossman Ultra Magnums. Those Hawkeyes, I have no idea. They're just what they are. But you'd notice that even though one was much heavier and one is a completely different shape, you know, pointed versus domed, it was kind of doing the same thing at 20 yards with, with both of them. So 25 yards, sorry. We're going to see what we're doing at 50 because we can. So Crossman Ultra Magnums. I don't know. <laughs> we're going to try it. <laughs> we're just going to do like we always do here. First, let's see if we can even hit the paper. That is the question. Yeah. <laughs> Before I take another shot, I am going to go take a look at it. It's not, not as far away as 100, so I'm just going to walk down there. Interesting. Very, very interesting. All right, so we're not on it yet. But let's try something here. I am going to go check it again. Okie dokie. Let's see. <laughs> so far, not so good. Let's see what happens here. Maybe if I come up a little. Let me take two. All right. Let me see where we're at, and then we'll keep going. Alrighty then. I think I know where we're hitting now. <laughs> Let's try this. We're just gonna, uh... All right, well. <laughs> there it is. Obviously, you see it before me. I'm going to go take a look at it and see what happened. Then we'll talk about it. Well, yeah, <laughs> not all that great at long distance, you know. We made an inch to hit some on the target, which is probably uh, more than enough to ask for, considering it is a pistol. But, yeah, we only got four actually hit the target. Not a very tight group. It's like, you know, a football field in between. But, uh, you know, you might get a better group with an optic. Uh, but really, they're, they're really spreading once they're out that far. And it's not going to be all that accurate. Like I said, past 20 yards probably. So, there you go. All right, so there you have it. Yeah, we landed on the target, but... It ain't no dime size group, and it certainly ain't no dollar size group, the bill that is. With that said, catch you all down the road. Yeah, I know you thought I left. Well, <laughs> I just want to say that I'm not happy with those results whatsoever, but I want to give it the fairest chance possible. I do have some high-end pellets coming in the mail, and when we get them in, we're going to see what those do. And other pellets that I have that obviously we didn't try, but uh, yeah, not happy with that. And so, but I'm not going to sit here and say that it can't be. Maybe it just doesn't like those pellets, which is definitely possible. We need to put different pellets through it and see what it's doing. If we're still getting the same results, then not good, not good. This is not over, folks. More to come yet with this one. So for real this time, I will catch you all down the road. Mm -hmm.